you guys know i'm a capcom shill but guess what we still gotta put things where it's meant to be in the trash can and that's where Jungli belongs in the trash can yo what's going on guys and we're making a tier list once again guys but we're gonna do this tier list based off fighting game tv shows and movies if you guys want to see the action and you know see the tier list hit the like share subscribe turn on the bell notification and let's get into the video Ooh, man these are a lot of bad movies we do S A B trash I've never seen before. Obviously, um, the Street Fighter 2 anime movie clearly S tier. I actually watched it recently, again, and it's it's obviously a blast. These movies I thought were cool, bro. The animated movies were actually dope. Timeless classic, amazing fight scene. Who doesn't forget about Chun Li and Vega? That's, that's probably the best fight in the whole movie, right? Like that's that one's too good. Mortal Kombat was actually god. I don't care what nobody say. I am a big fan of Mortal Kombat 1. Mortal Kombat 1 definitely hit mad different, bro. I, I will put the music on, but I don't think, I don't want to get copyrighted, but come on, dog. If this is Mortal Kombat 1, then this is def definitely the best, one of the best movies of all time. Original Mortal Kombat is just super, super good because what is trash is Mortal Kombat 2. Mortal Kombat 2 is actually trash. When they decided to bring animality and kill off Johnny Cage in like the first three seconds, it was already a trash ass movie, especially with the Bangor Mortal Kombat 1 with, with, that, with that music. You know what I mean? That music was just so good. Clubs still play that music up to this day. You know, the Sub-Zero and Liu Kang fight, Johnny Cage and, and Scorpion. Those were just like the iconic fights that were just too good. Now we have the Street Fighter live action movie. And to be honest, it's not the worst thing in the world. The first Street Fighter movie, I thought this movie was good, bro. I don't care what nobody said. It was pretty fun. Bison was cool in this movie. I don't care what nobody said. Definitely was all over the place, but definitely a cool movie. I thought it was really fun at this point. It's funny. It's good. It has charm. But because of that, we got to put the Jean-Claude Van Damme one onto A. Kind of sus, but we're here for the laughter. It's, it's, it's definitely better than Mortal Kombat 2 just because like, oh, I just don't like the animality. But the, the whole bison on joystick playing a mini game, I think that was pretty spectacular. It did well enough that they made their own video game. Obviously, Street Fighter the movie video game. So obviously, that's why we have to put it into A because they really they really try to push that bad boy, right? 90s was a very, very special time. We had a lot of crazy ass characters, a lot of crazy ass movies, but it was pretty damn good. All right, A T. King of Fighters. King of Fighters is definitely trash. I'm going to be honest, man. No, bro. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm going to be honest, bro. No, dog. I'm sorry, man. I don't know what's it about. It doesn't do anything about King of Fighters. Iori's in a relationship with Mai, but it, it there was nothing King of Fighters related. Like, nothing about it was King of Fighters whatsoever, so that's why it was so trash. <laughs> I think it was, what, Street Fighter Assassin's Fist? This is actually pretty okay. I, I thought it was pretty cool. I think it was way better than most Street Fighter movies right that wasn't animated Legend, legend of chung lee completely garbage you guys know i'm a capcom shill but guess what we still gotta put things where it's meant to be in the trash can and that's where the legend of chung lee belongs in the trash can oh my god this street fighter garbage bro oh my god watch this bro how did they make so many bad street fighter movies man if this the mortal combat that the main character was a random ass dude and his power was getting the plot armor ho young is a, is a is the main character a random character who has never been before in the Mortal Kombat universe is the main character of this game the movie was good until he was there he was complete poo poo actually i say the movie was actually pretty ass bro my man's special power was plot armor literally plot armor i hate this movie the first 10 minutes of the movie was the best thing i ever seen in my life and guess what they just said nah that's all you get we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna you're gonna have you're gonna watch some whack movie after that when i think about it the only character that was actually od was kano kano was actually od in that movie the fight at the end was good but it just it just took too long bro tekken is pretty trash i'm not gonna lie if i'm not mistaken this came out uh early 2000s if i'm not mistaken oh no oh no this actually came out in 2014. I actually think they, these are just, I think this is better, bro. Another movie that really didn't make any sense, but it was, I guess they did it more for fan service is DOA. I, I don't think it's worse as any of these movies. So I guess we'll have to give it to a B bad, but it's not like trash bad, right? 
Uh, because another movie that is trash bad is Where Are You? Just a Tekken live action movie. That one was completely trash. Jin was just kind of a pimp and he just had many intimate encounters with many women in the Tekken universe, I guess. I, that's what I, from what I remember when I was just fast forwarding the movie because there's no way I could stand two hours of just watching that movie. This is Tekken Bloodvenge. I think I remember this. This one was okay. It was an all right movie. Bloodline? I think that was S. The fights were so good and they, they really showed off a lot of like moves. Like you could see like characters moves. Um, and resembles from the Tekken game itself. Tekken Bloodline. This sh was cool, bro. Virtual Fighter, golden. Ooh, Fatal Fury, I remember this. Fatal Fury is pretty cool. I like Fatal Fury a lot. Street Fighter 2 anime series, definitely A tier. They really gave Akuma a new attack. They gave him, he could first, for some reason he can earth bend. When he first came about, he was he was able to earth bend. He was able to water bend. He put, he put uh, Ken in a bubble uh, so to make to have it a one on one fight so there's no dramatic battle nonsense. They were able to go the whole series, like literally from start to finish. And they finally conquer Shadowloo with Sagat and Guile teaming up together and just drawing tiger shots and signing booms at Bison over and over again. And I, I thought that was great. Was this the Scorpion movie? Yeah, this one was okay. I like this one. But the Mortal Kombat cartoon is godlike. It's definitely actually better than Street Fighter just because they you know, the whole the whole out, out world, Earth realm and everything like they they were going hard in it and they took it more seriously compared to Street Fighter 2 animated. So I definitely think Mortal Kombat was super fun to watch. Oh, this is the Mortal Kombat will come down, right? I thought this was all right. The Street Fighter 4 one that was came with the Blu-ray and I thought that one was pretty good. Like that it, it's not, you know, obviously the GOAT of all time. See, Viper was was botting some cami. Dog Stalkers, this one was a tier like it's it, it could have been better. Like they had the right formula, but they didn't go I guess they played it too safe and I get it like dog stalkers, vampire saviors is it's one of those things that's really hard to not play safe. Um, it's really hard like like to, in order to make it good, you need to not play safe, but they played it way too safe because I guess that's Capcom's thing. Dog stalkers revenge. I thought this was pretty cool. I like this one, but again, I grew up on it, so it might not be as crazy. It's crazy how Dog Stalkers movies or shows was just in the 90s, bro, just killing it. And I didn't see any of it besides the Revenge one. Oh, this one was a masterpiece too, bro. Oh man, I missed this. If I had to pick my favorite, the Street Fighter Alpha movie was dope. This, the series is dope. This one, Generations was super cool. This one was really got like Street Fighter 2, the movie, broken, masterpiece. Mortal Kombat 1. I'm gonna be honest, guys. I, I think this sucks. <laughs> I, I like this movie though, man. I don't care what the body said. I like this movie. This is my favorite trash movie, okay? This is my list. Hope you guys like it. This is definitely what I what I watch. This is my tier list. You guys let me know in the comment section below, okay? Other than that, hit the like, share, subscribe, turn on the bell notification, and we'll see you next one. Peace.